We are looking at the foot birthday icon Puskas, who has got five star weak foot. It's got four star skill, left footed, high medium, five foot eight. Can you play striker or centre forward? But look at these stats. It's an unbelievable card, like ridiculously good. Out of this world passing, out of this world shooting. Look at 97 shot power, 98 finishing, 90 acceleration, 97 composure, and agility and balance is unbelievable. He's got really good traits as well. Shane doesn't have finesse shot, but he has got very, very good traits. We are playing this in draft. Unfortunately, I can't afford to buy the card outright. We'll talk about Kemp Styles pricing, what I thought about the card, and much more at the end of the view on Footbin. That being said, let's go jump into some gameplay, but have a word from today's sponsor first. Are you tired of playing sweat teams like this? Make sure you go to Alt Night, select Foot, select Foot 23 coins, choose which console and how many coins you'd like to buy, select your payment method, and don't forget to add code NANIC for 6% off on all orders. So with Puskas today, his main job is just to get goals non-stop. Using his prime and his mid and every other version of the card, he's just always so clinical, but the downside has always been his weak foot. So we're going to see if that's going to be a massive problem today or not. All right, here we go. Underway, got Puskas there. A little layoff. Puskas on the ball. Oh, he feels rapid in terms of doing skill. All the way through. Left foot, top corner. <laughs> This card is ridiculous. His elastic dribbling is so responsive. You know if he's in front of goal, he's getting that goal, that's for sure. And that's a great start from him. Puskas got the keeper out of goal. Can we go for the long rob? Oh, it's a poor shot from me in the end. Puskas on the ball. He's got that layoff. Good right foot pass out there considering he's left footed. Puskas, left foot across goal. Bang, back of the net. And this looks like a cheat code of a card already. Got Puskas on the ball here. He's so responsive in the skill move. He's so... That's oh, a terrible foul, referee. He's so responsive on the skill moves. He's so quick as well when it comes to the dribbling and the pace. And he gives you so many options in terms of playing that position. Like, for example, here... Oh, my own player attacked me, though, unfortunately. But you can see just how quick he is on recovery. But you can see just how quick he is on recovery. Little one-two. Now we've got the space in behind. One more. Puskas, first-time shot. And it is a hat-trick for him within 10 minutes or 13 minutes. And this is a really, really top-level meta card. It looks like we could be getting a rage quit here. We shall see. But one thing always with Puskas in particular is his ability to open up the space and get that left foot shot. If you let him shoot with his left foot, it's going in every single time. We can see here 8.3. He's got five dribbles, four complete. Four shots out of four on target. Three goals. That's how clinical he is in his passes. Let's go jump into another game. Puskas on the ball. Got a bit of options there. Good little ball run. I got the through ball. Great pass. Bit of work to do. First guy's using that right foot this time. And again, I'm telling you, inside the box, he is an absolute threat. So clinical up front there. Because with the uh, five-star weak foot on his right foot, you can go either way now, which you couldn't do with Puskas before. And it just takes him to that next level. How wide. Got Puskas on the inside. It's a lovely pass. Right foot across goal and a great save from the goalkeeper. Very hard angle there. We can see we're getting in behind quite a lot with him. Got Puskas making that run. Got a lot of work to do on his own. Good dribble in. Good hold up play there. Back to him. And a again, an absolute unbelievable last ditch talons. They ain't going to keep happening. We're going to get that shot off in a minute and get the goal. But you can see how quick he is on the dribble to create the space. All right, counter tag. Got Puskas running in between the lines. A great pass. Nowhere to go. Going to hold it up again. Good tackle. Pressure's on. Nowhere to go. Great tackle from his team here, Kevin De Bruyne. And again, a really good tackle. This guy picks the ball up. He's completely on his own here. No one to help. No problem. Good hold up play. Out wide. We will have a look at Puskas' set pieces. So he's got 97, 90, 94, and 94. So he's very, very good. We are going to play it short to him, though. See if we can open up the space on the edge of the box. Great pass in. Falls to Cordoba. If it fell to anybody else but Cordoba, we probably would have had a goal there. Let's go counter-attack. Got Puskas pinned between the lines. Great pass. He's got a lot of work to do here. Using that pace. Again, a last-ditch slide tackle has stopped us from getting a shot off there. Great tackle. Puskas. Left foot. And there is a winning goal, possibly. He gets a chance. Left foot. His left foot or right foot. He is a top, top finisher. I can't say it enough. He scores so many clutch goals for us. And again, getting another massive goal for us here. Possibly to win the game. Let's go counter-attack. Again, push gas, driving. 
Gets my tyres. Gonna hold it up for a minute. Lay it off. Great hold up play. Now got the ball behind. We can find him. We can. Oh, it's a good tackle again. Got a couple options here. Push gas again. Using that pace. Going across. Dribble past the goalkeeper. Got the angle, and again it's blocked. How have we not had a goal? I don't know there. I don't know how we didn't get a penalty either. Bad from our opponent has given us the space. Pesca has got the little through ball. Ah, he gets tackled in front. It's a good pass, but JJ Kocha could not help us there. Read that pass, so. Got Puskas in between the lines. Hold up play. He's going to hold it up, slow it down a little bit. And we get ourselves a winning goal again. Really good play from the team. Puskas providing that strength. Getting the triangle passes off, then dummy running away and giving us that extra space we needed. And that is the game. Really, really tough second game we had. Puskas may only got one or two goals, but he was so instrumental in the game. And what I mean by this is you can see here he got two goals for us. He had uh, 28 dribbles, 17 complete, four shots, three on target, and two goals. So when he did get the shot off, right foot or left foot, he got the goal. His passing here, 20 passes, 19 complete. And he basically just kept making the runs for us, getting the space. Our opponent made about four or five last-ditch tackles to stop us from basically getting a goal. And if you keep doing that, eventually we're going to get through and get the goal. And that's exactly what happened. So let's go jump over to Footbin now. So Puskas is coming in at 4.6 million, more or less. He's about 4,000 coins short of that. We went to compare him to his prime. His prime has got plus two on the pace, but minus ones or everything else. Sorry, minus two on the pace, but plus one, plus twos and everything else. He has three-star weak foot, four-star skill. So you are paying for that plus two weak foot upgrade. And I'll tell you what, it is massive. That's always been Puskas' problem that is weak foot. And today it really come through. And you can see how clinical he is. Just with a basic on him, his card is really, he's a 95 rate striker just outright. But he's a 97 cam or a 97 center forward with just a basic chem style on him. We have a look at chem styles down here. People say an engine catalyst or hunter. With an engine, let's see what it does. In terms of an engine, it makes him explosive. And you can see here, still 97s and everything else. So you're basically getting yourself a 97 rated icon. And it just maximizes that agility and balance as well as boosting up his pace. His passing gets massively boosted. This guy can play left wing, right wing, striker, secondary striker, cam, center forward. Whatever system you're going to play, he is going to do it. Because of his stocky build, which is interesting, but because he's 5 foot 8, with this extremely high agility and balance, his left stick dribbling is second to none. He can do the skill moves if he had to do phantom glides and much more. He's going to open the space. But again, that five-star weak foot means your opponent never knows if you're going to go left or right with the passing. Doesn't know if you're going to go left or right with the shooting. Whereas before, push gas, that was always his kind of his problem. And you can just see how well it comes through. And he is very, very, very clinical in his finishing. I think in terms of prices, Puskas, one of those ones, it will be about 2 to 3 million for a long, long time. Yes, it will drop down, depending on what SBCs EA decide to bring out. For example, if we get an SBC that guarantees a foot birthday icon on, panic will set in, his price will go down. But I generally think it will hold because this will be the best version of Puskas. He is extremely top tier meta and he will just up anybody's team in terms of levels. But as always, if you have any questions about this card or any other card, comment down below. And if you're new to the channel, hit that like button and subscribe. Catch you in the next one. See ya.